Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Node.js. Today we are going to learn how to create an Excel file with Node.js. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here we go with the locations. Where, where is my Node.js project? So not this, not this also, not yeah, this is open with that application okay let's create a new file that is excel.js okay so here first of all we have to copy and paste this code and explain you later so just paste this right hide this okay so first of all what we have to do we have to install the package that is excel for node so let's go and just close this and just open over here the terminal okay so we will use nvm use node 20 okay okay fine because node is not correct but nvm use 20 will work npm i excel for node install this package Okay, this is done. The next step would be <coughs> node <coughs> excel.js. Okay, let's try to hit enter. Excel file generated. Let's have a look. Where is Excel file? So, where is he? Here is to see that example.xls. Okay, so here we have which file example.xls will generate. So, this is the file. Let's open with the text, not this. We will go to the folder and just open it example.xls with this so discard yes so here you can see the excel file is there okay with name age and the country right so this is we have added right so let's see how we have done this okay so first of all require the excel for note package <coughs> create a new workbook so here we go with this we have, this is a workbook that is sheet one okay so the name is sheet one define some data to be written on the excel file so name age country so the name and the age so this is the data that you want to define loop through each data and write to the worksheet so this is the method so data dot for each we are looping for each cell and the cell index worksheet dot cell row index plus one cell index plus one string cell dot string so here we have all the data right so here loop through the data and write it to the worksheet okay so this is done after this save the workbook to a file so workbook dot write so here we have to make the file name okay so if there is any error it will show else it will show that the excel file generated successfully okay so whenever you write whenever you have the like you know project or something where you want to write in an excel sheet so this is the best method that you can use any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day